Ladies and gentlemen of the court, MI6, the roundhouse, my apartment, Sydney, Regatti, and Park One. And in Canada, I don't know anybody yet to give the shit to, so. Oh, yeah, and Russia, Victoria. We had a little bit yesterday from our system. Our system. No fourth exploitation on their stolen system. All together. Really nice. Then we understand that their passports are in Belgium. ID cards. They think to work like Secret Service. And they are separated from ID card. Hiding in UK, Canada, Australia, and United States with fraud passports. Now, I at least can say that I still have my shit in my pocket, even if it's revoked. And they cannot, or they have to have an old ID card with them too, right? Now, mine is still valid, so called till 2026. But I am a confirmed Brit and a confirmed Australian. And I have screenshots of it, of the confirmation, and I send it to the court. And I say, fuck you, ID frauds. Because you think work like a secret service agent that gets deployed with three passports. And you ain't, and you ain't an assistant, because I didn't need an assistant either, like a June acted as she was my secretary. I didn't need an assistant. It's you working, the people from Rigati and Park One and Round and Sydney with five females now. Not one. And Russia, my Victoria with a team that I don't even mention the fucking amount of. But then the cyber attack at Israel was really interesting, wasn't it? By so-called Russia and Anonymous and... But then guess who helped me in 2018 to fucking fuck over Sportpolis Antwerp? Because these guys literally went straight in while Tina didn't. So these boys had an attack back, you understand that, right? And I found some guys of Anonymous who were literally forced with Mitakis in their hands and they blasted off. And that was a young dude and he wouldn't, he was high. But then we are going to talk about the son of Francois, who also was a hacker and was always in my laptop. And that was 2006. And that was a little fuck up. So Francoise gave me a blowjob or two in Sportpalais. I ain't gonna say no to that. She was with a guy called... I don't know what this guy was with. That dude was fucking with me anyway. And she thought payback and she came on to me in the toilets of Sportpalais. And she went on her knees and I thought, hell yeah, you know. That was fun. Yeah. I had sex with several. Six. I never forced myself up. I also experimented with a lesbian girl called Hattie. She uh, was condemned by her parents. And we did exactly the same. Then I had a relationship with a nurse called Joke. Joke. Preter. Then Tamara Janssens, and then Ellen, a girl I paid at the venue, and she looked exactly like a girl I worked there, and she took the sister's name, because her name was something else, but her sister was Ellen, and she ended up uh, preggy, and that could be my baby, I can honestly tell you that. So then a bitch ass Wendy terrorist starts thinking to intimidate me, what was the best sex you ever had? And I sit straight into her fucking face, Ellen. And she started crying and raping me. Yeah, she couldn't handle that. Because that fucking hot blonde vash was literally a no-no. A mental cow that threw the whole dishes at your head and cardboard milk and attack with the knife and you always have to defend yourself. Only if you ask like this. Why did you say that to my uncle and aunt her that you said that? And then this was the reaction. <laughs> started throwing shit. Now, she was borderline severe, mental disturbed, and she started spreading shit behind my back all the time. And when I confronted her with that in a calm way, that was what you got back. And then she called the police, and I was an abuser. There was moments she even threw the dog and glass when kids were on the 
bare feet and they called the ambulance and said, Mama, Mama, that's strange, please come send an ambulance. That was my daughter. Uh, and they saw God said that I was a bad idea, right? She shot him. March 2020. Man. Now, Belgium never protected. Athena never protected. Alina never protected. Smacking kids around to get adrenaline in the blood, drain blood, behead them, put chips in the head, use for brute force, and then say that all oh, some kind of terrorist organizations are doing now hack on Israel for intelligence because they have the best system in the world together with Russia. It's the same as saying North Korea just hacked the middle of the government, but but it's Belgium that sells nuclear material to North Korea and sells all the shit all over. Now, then you understand that uh, Il, how he sends uh, nuclear shit in the air, where the material come from, and also where the 185 bombs came from that they bought back as dirty bombs they plastered in Japan, Nevada and Sussex. Mm. And still found all over, just like the wonder of radiation is also a hive. Fabiano is radiated with it. Now they use it on several spots, and then you hear them all say the same ODJ! ODJ! What I do now is I blast the shit. And that takes immediately 150, 200 of those motherfuckers down that literally smack bitches or females around to be head, lick their pussy, and the moment they cut their head off with four SRTs and the one thinks he has the blood of the victim la 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 in their, in their crazy mind they are way superior so I'm gonna upload this on YouTube by the way and I'm gonna put it in a link I ain't gonna put this one public because I already had shit uh, deleted um, like the copper material that was so called the world organization when I refer I didn't even refer to COVID I said the material of the chip, the copper, the 95% conduction and the palladium on the trackers and the gold on the whatever connectors made used in these micro fucking chips, rice grain chips from all over. Like Toki, uh, the Schweinerei, I call it, it. Literally, it's their own fucking destruction name. It's a German chip, they call Schweinerei. And you have two Canadian ones, then you have the, the Mati and the Milena which is the SRT and the Superbot, but the training bot from Russia and the border bot from Canada are also used for like the prostate and the organs. Remember that, because it's gonna be used on you too. They do it on everybody. Excellent. And ladies from Regatti and Park One, Mia, Lydia, uh, uh, Linda, uh, um, uh, Amanda, and Victoria from Russia, then I don't even know the names from all in UK in the roundhouse, the one that I bought, and uh, Sydney, five girls, stay strong, I'm gonna get Canada to that too, and some Israel, mm -hmm. Gull is already in, I already know, so, our system rules, they wanna put speaker cells, we go, in the material and the material our snakes or their whatever bitch fucking world domination software they use is self-created and with approval of federal government by the way and paid as well like that over swiss bank accounts with other oh yeah so i also refer to how uh, id cards and passports get abused over so-called mug shots or arrests and that I explained to the judge as well on how these switch bank accounts in these artists' names and all were created. Just like they wanted to abuse mine while I was in a war in Finland or uh, in a hospital in so-called Belgium in 2014 for 100 million. But they stole my ID card first in a spot where uh, homeless people sleep. Yeah, they pushed me on the street over the force of my mom after winning the human rights court. They also thought to abuse the license plate of a Volkswagen 2. So for that one too, that was in my mom's name by the way. And the Volkswagen 2 was sabotaged in Strasbourg as they cut my axle on my steering wheel. So, and I was driving really slow when the shit broke down and I even used that car as a sleeping bunk. 
because I took my back seat out. I always had material in my trunk, and I slept in that car. But I took me a walk of 11 kilometers to the city center to eat. Back there to go to human rights court. Meanwhile, that family was under attack. The lady had a sister and two kids that was under attack and never informed me. At that point, I also identified the mayor, who was a criminologist and um, working for that uh, internal affairs shit that I uh, contacted. And these guys were laughing in my face when I saw him on a McDonald's with his fraud cops. Meanwhile, no numbers abuse from Canada. I saw Lizzie Pass, Chloe came ask me a fire. Uh, yeah, I could identify some that I also identified and got it. And some I took out, and some are fucking bitches, as they so-called now want to integrate in France because they think they are better protected there. You understand that, right? Excellent.